Hey guys, welcome back to placement.org. Today, I am sharing my big binary interview experience with you all and how I banked an offer for 10 lakhs per annum. Before starting the video, I just wanted to tell you guys that if you are preparing for your placements, then the video which is present on the top right corner of your screen is most important for you guys as it contains some important links in a document which I referred to crack all the interviews. So let's get started. First of all, I'll tell you the process which I went through. First is the coding round, then the technical interview, then a bar raiser round, a director's round, and then if you clear this all, you get an offer later. If you guys are really interested in developing mobile applications and web applications, then only you must join Big Binary. Okay, this is the company which has its domain in these two fields. Coming to the first round, the coding round. The duration of this round was 2 hours and we had to solve 7 questions. The difficulty level varied from easy to hard and even one of the questions which I encountered was stock buy and sell. Okay, this is the question which I encountered for the third time in a different company's coding round. Alright, and for qualifying to the next round, minimum, at least you need to solve four questions. Okay, that is not mentioned, but on an average, you at least need to solve four questions. In my case, I solved completely four questions, means all the test cases passed for four, and for one question only partially, the test cases were passed. And that's how I qualified for my first technical interview. The technical interview was around 20 to 25 minutes. Okay, while appearing for the interview, especially for the big binary, you must know what projects you have done and the thorough knowledge of how the implementation is done and how the project is working. And especially if your project is in a web development domain, then they will pick up that project and ask you everything about it. Okay, you must be thorough with your computer networks and database concepts. They don't focus on operating systems that much. Okay. The questions which I encountered related to my projects were that how the APIs work, how they communicate with each other, what are the ways and everything. Okay. And then he even asked me that related to computer networks that if a client does not send a request to the server, can the server respond back? Okay. As per the knowledge I had, I replied that no, sir, we cannot. And then a counter question to me was that then how does the WhatsApp group work? This was where I failed. I was a bit hanged. Okay, I was not able to answer this question, but till that point, he had came to know that, okay, I have a great understanding on this subjects, but I was just weak in some areas. So on this note, the interview ended. And after a week, I got a call that, yeah, I am selected for the bar is around. Coming to the bar is around, it was around 30 to 35 minutes, but to my surprise, they even questioned me on system design. Okay, this was my first ever interview, which was based on system design. I had no clue that what would come through, but uh, going for this round, I just read all the architectures which are present, such as the web server architecture and all. Okay, and they even said that they will be testing my coding skills, so I was completely fine with that. So starting with the system design, he asked me that we have to design a weather application and he even provided me some details that how will I implement this feature. We had a discussion around 15 to 20 minutes. The most part of the interview was focused on that. And then he even questioned me that what is the difference between cookies and local storage then when can we use cookies local storage and that all things then he asked me that how can we make a website faster that uh, how should we keep the html where should we load the pages then the size of the images and that all i answered in this way and then uh, coming to my coding skills he asked me the famous hut problem this problem is mentioned on hacker earth okay i'm not sure what's the title of the problem but i encountered that on uh, Hacker Earth after some time. It was a pretty simple and easy logic. 
uh, using arrays okay i took around five minutes to solve the question you don't have to type the code you just have to convince him your approach is great he was satisfied then he asked me a simple question regarding the finding an index of a particular value in an array and first time he gave me an unsorted array so i said that okay we would do it in an linear time complexity and after that he provided me with an <coughs> sorted array and i answered him the binary search would be the best algorithm and then counter question was that the time complexity of binary search is log n so why it is log n so i said that log n means basically divided by two and whenever we are searching we are performing a binary search then every time we reduce the array of size in which we are searching by two so he felt very convinced with this and after a few days i got an email that i qualified for the director's round now director's round i would say it was just a formality where the director just wanted to know the candidates which were selected and their communication skills there were no technical questions asked just the discussion about the company the policies and just a feedback about the previous round and how the interview was so not much to worry about i would say if you qualified the first two interviews and that's how i banged off as i mentioned this is a must watch video if you are preparing for your placements okay this video contains the explanation of what questions i prepared for all my interviews and even in the description there is a document mention which contains the link for the preparation of the subjects like component networks database management and operating systems if you guys are preparing for placement then you must also follow the instagram page placement.com here i daily post interview questions and even coding questions which are asked in some famous interviews okay so if you like the content if this video was somehow helpful to you please give a like and subscribe to my channel stay safe thank you